clothes all over the place. Think Arnvold might have been in a hurry. And a lone shoe. Unlike him, he paid attention to- The Song of Bran the Conqueror. Bran the Conqueror is a hero to Clan Tuersic. He took Skellige's crown by force, was killed soon after. Interesting, but it's hardly proof. Beautiful things. All pretty much useless to us. We should take every- An empty envelope. Hmm. Sounds familiar. Must say I envy you that. Ambergris. Means a user of perfume. That's the scent to follow. A hidden compartment? Hmm. Maybe I ought to try Arnvold's key. A letter. I told you. Smell it. Burn his perfume. Never liked it. Horribly suffocating. Might have guessed it was her. What was her motive? It's obvious. She schemed this up to get rid of the other claimants. Slander our clan in the process. If she succeeded, Svanriga would have been left. The only claimant to Skellige's throne. Read that letter already. Instructions on how to spike the mead. Some promises, but it's neither signed nor sealed. Think it's enough? It's got to be. We shouldn't delay any longer. Time to gather the yarls. I've assembled the Jarls in council as you demanded, Ceres on Crate. You claim to know who's behind the slaughter at Kaer Trolda. Speak then. The blood of Skellige's sons and daughters. Whose hands does it stain? Buna Brands. The lass is mad. Do you think anyone will believe you? You had them serve poison mead to the berserkers. I beg your pardon. The servants of Kaer Trolda are not mine to command. It was your father who called for the feast, who assembled the guests. There's reason in these words. It was my father's cub-bearer, Arnvald, who helped him. Bearing a bribe, Arnvald, he tried to kill me and the Witcher. What? Arnvald? No oh, shite. Arnvald is Crack's loyal dog. I thank you, Lugos. But so be it. Let us hear the slander you've commanded him to repeat. Bring him in. He's dead, and I wager it was you who silenced him. I am not surprised to see you lie, Ceres. After all, like father, like daughter. But your lie is clumsy, and that does surprise me. Silence, Berna. And you, Ceres, how do you aim to prove your accusation? One more piece of evidence. A letter from Berna to Arnvald, instructing him how to spike the mead. It lacks my signature. It lacks my seal. But the hand is that of a woman. And you... <laughs> is this your proof, lass? Is this what you call evidence of my supposed treason? Don't make me laugh. Burn is right, Ceres. Tis all precious little proof of her wrongdoing. Alas, your brother Hjalmar also has not presented anything that could clear your family's name. We've but one path left to us. Holger, Lugos, it's time we quit this damn castle. Come, we must decide what punishment Clan on Crate will face. A 
I'm sorry, Sirius. Wait! Mother, you bade me to leave the hall before the feast. Why? Son, not now. Why did you do it? How did you know? Hi! You stand silent. You gave Ceres no credence. Gave the Witcher no credence. But you must give credence to a son who accuses his own mother. The massacre was her doing. She shamed herself. Me. The family. The clan. Swan Riga, I did it for you. Only for you. You admit to this deed. As the eldest of the Jarls, I cleanse the name of Clan on Crea. And you, Berna Bran, I sentence to death. You will be chained to a rock to perish of hunger and thirst, and sea fowl will peck apart your remains. Lust for power, I knew this, but so strong as to commit such a crime. What about Svanriga? What's his fate? He'll lose his home, his name, his honor. He'll choose exile. Death. But enough. Whatever comes, we must endure. I thank you, Geralt. Again? No need. Again. I'll not take any more of this modesty. This is a land of heroes. Let this remind you of that. And now, I must ride for Gedinate, for the Jarl's council. Time to pick a king. What do you think? Who'll get the nod? Come with me. See for yourself. All may listen to our deliberations. I do have a horse in the race. Can't refuse, to be honest. As I thought. Well, let's go. Just in time. They've already started. Worth long ago, we gave King Bran back to the sea. Today, our mourning ends. Today, by the grace of the gods and the clans, a new ruler takes the crown. Let us swear her fealty. in my place. I thank those who stood at my side. Here, beneath the sacred oak, I pledge to be a good queen to the ones and the others. I want peace and prosperity to reign in Skellige. And I count on you to help me fulfill that dream. Ceres! 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 What's the new Queen of Skellige planning? Um, to 
listen, learn, and listen again. Then we'll see. Good plan. I must unite the clans. I'd rather avoid war, but if Nilfgaard aims to attack, we must repel them together. Drummond folk might be a problem. I saw Lugas during the ceremony. Furious, to say the least. There's always been strife between our clans. But I must try and talk to him. Just might bring him around. Keep my fingers crossed. Farewell. You all right? So-so. Anyway you cut it, I was bested by a wench. Not just any wench. Aye, true. Suppose if it had to be so, I'm glad it was Ceres. Not even a little proud of her? Come on, admit it. A bit, aye. She's the blood of me blood, bone of me bone. But don't tell her I said so. Liable to puff out her chest. Which would do her good now I think of it. <laughs> we showed Lugos. That's most important. Did you see that rage grip him? I thought he'd burst. Yeah, surprised to see him in that much of a half, actually. Our clans have been button heads, chests, bellies forever. It's the lay of the land. Take care, Yalmar. Looks to me you're near bursting with pride. <laughs> if only you knew, Wolf. Tell me, what other Yarl can boast children like mine? Shame their mother didn't live to see this. Ceres will make a good queen. Maybe she can finally unite the clans. Let's hope. And if not, she'll always have me and Yalma. If the need arises, we take up arms for her. Wounded and tired, Ciri collapsed in the swamp. Some peasants found her and took her to the Baron, Velen's self-appointed ruler. The warlord took the young woman in, had her nursed back to health, then sent her on.